Welcome back to our channel. In this video, let us see interesting curves using simple mathematics resulting in hypocycloid. It is created in Python program with animation using Mathplotlet. A hypocycloid is generated by the trace of a fixed point on a small circle that rolls within a larger circle. Before seeing its implementation in Python, please subscribe to our channel if you have not already subscribed. Let us understand the properties of hypocycloid from Wikipedia. As we can see, the fixed circle is in black color whose radius is capital R and the moving circle, the smaller one, which rolls within the fixed circle is of radius small r. P is a point fixed on the rim of the moving circle and the parametric equation for this curve is a function of radius of fixed circle and radius of the moving circle with cos and cosine theta. Knowing these properties, let us move to the implementation in Python. As usual, I have numpy and matplotlib imported to our file. Uh, it would be easy if the axis is made up so that our curves are very clearly visible. Let me take the uh, needed samples by using linspace. So theta is nothing but uh, 400 samples which are equally distanced between 0 and 30 times the pi are the values for theta. So linspace 0 to 30 times pi and let me take 400 samples which are equally distanced. So the value of theta has 400 samples. Radius of uh, the fixed circle shall be 37 and radius of the moving small circle shall be 19. Uh, the 15, let me take 15 for the radius of small circle. And by knowing the parametric equation, x and y are functions of radius of fixed circle and radius of moving circle along with cos theta and sin theta where theta is 400 sample which are equally spaced between 0 and 30 times of pi. Now let us plot this one and see how our curve looks like before adding the uh, fixed circle and moving circle along with animation. For that let me pass x and y parameters and plot the curve as uh, uh, green color with a hyphen and give the line width as and show the plot. Let us see how our curve will look like first. Uh, this is our hypocycloid but as mentioned we want uh, the hypocycloid or the curve plotted within the fixed circle by a moving circle and the point P which is fixed on the rim of the moving circle shall plot as this curve. We need to draw a, a fixed circle and the moving circle within the fixed circle. For that first let us have 5 which takes 100 samples within 0 and 10 times the pi. So 5 equal to np lint space 0 to 10 times pi provided by num package and let us take 100 equally distant samples. First let us draw a, a large circle which is fixed to 1. As usual to draw the circle it is a function of uh, cos and uh, sin pi. As it is fixed we will pass the large circle x and large circle y coordinate. Let us indicate that with a red color with a v shape and line width of 1. As it is fixed I have directly called this uh, plot function. Let us run this and then see how it looks like. Uh, we have the fixed large cycle and the curve hypercycloid inside it. Now we will move on to draw the moving small circle and the animation with which the fixed point on the moving circle shall bring us this hypocycloid. For that first let us have the small circle which is also the function of uh, cos and sine functions. And their radius is small r. Yes. Now this will plot as the small circle. But we don't want the small circle to be fixed. We want that to be moving. Which can be achieved only with the animation. And how much it has to move. The small circle has to move. Within the fixed circle. Shall be indicated as delta x and delta y. Which is nothing but. 
capital R minus small r that is the difference of their radius times the cos theta where theta is nothing but the 400 samples we have taken from 0 to 30 times the num pi which are equally distanced and similarly uh, the delta y shall also be difference of their radius with sin theta times. So every time the small circle shall be moved by delta x and y within the fixed circle. And the values of these things shall be stored in the list. So let me have the list as uh, hypocycloid. Initially it is empty and the next list that I want is the circle itself because the small circle is a moving one so the circle itself has to be a list and the third one is the point p which is fixed point on the moving rim of the moving circle so with these three lists we will append calculate and append the values which shall be plotted as a curve in order to have the animation of the curve let us call function animation method and define a function animate which shall update the values to these lists that is hypocycloid to draw the curve circle list which is the value for the moving circle and the points which is a point fixed point on the rim of the moving circle which brings out the hypocycloid curves and shall pass frames value of 400 to this animate function called at an interval of 50 milliseconds in order to use this function animate we have to import it from matplotlib animation so from matplotlib animation let us import function animation so we have this imported and let us define the function animate as we recollect it shall take the parameter frames let me indicate it as i the value of i ranges from 0 to 400 as provided by the frames and this shall update as the value for these three lists. So, our animate function shall plot the value as small circle with delta x. And hypocycloid is the one which already we have calculated for x and y. And every time it shall only pass the value from the list of i plus 1 indicated as green color and the point on the rim shall be indicated as a, a bigger circle in magenta color which shall is again as a function of x and y as we have to animate it these values are appended to our lists and at any time we should have only one moving circle so if there are more than one moving circle we will remove the values out of it so this is our animate function called within the method function animate as already we are going to plot the hyperbolic within the animate function i am going to remove this outside the animate function now on executing it let us see how it comes up we are getting our hypocycloid curve the point p that is fixed point on the rim of the moving circle plots as the hypocycloid curve within the fixed circle of radius capital r hope you liked the video please give a like and subscribe to our channel